This video demonstrates the steps to enable debug with Control M Manage File Transfer. We will demonstrate the steps to enable debug with Control M Manage File Transfer from the command line on Linux and Windows servers and how to enable debug from the Control M Configuration Manager. The process is the same for Windows servers. We will now demonstrate how to enable debug for Control M Manage File Transfer from the command line in Linux. This is done on the agent where Control M Manage File Transfer is installed. The recommended debug level to obtain logs is 5. Please note that this will enable debug for all Control M agent processes and not just for Control M Manage File Transfer. Log on to the Control M agent where Control M Manage File Transfer is installed as the Control M agent user and run the following commands AGDBGLVL5. Once testing is complete or the issue captured, stop debug with the command AGDBGLVL5. Zero. It is important to stop the debug as large files can be created if it is left on. AGDBG LVL will in initialize a new log file in the Control M agent's proc log directory. Look for the latest file that starts with the name agdbglvl underscore. We will now demonstrate how to enable debug from the Control M Configuration Manager. From version 9.0.18 and above, the previous methods still work but it is now possible to enable debug only for a specific Control M module. To enable debug from the Control M Configuration Manager for Control M Managed File Transfer, log into the Control M Configuration Manager. Go to the agent that has Control M Managed File Transfer installed and that you want to place into debug. Right click and select Configuration Management. Set the debug level to 5. And click OK. Once testing is complete or the issue captured, stop debug by setting the debug level back to 0. Right click on Control M Manage File Transfer, Configuration Management, and Set Reset the, back to zero. Click OK. It is important to stop the debug as large files can be created if it is let, left on. The output from the debug can be found in the proc log directory of the agent. Because we are only putting Control M Manage File Transfer into debug, the output is logged to the CTM AFT log file. That concludes this Control M video. Thank you for your time. Please visit our knowledge base and subscribe to our YouTube channel for more videos like this.